West Virginia Attorney General Patrick Morrissey stopped by 12 News Today to discuss a variety of different issues. Among those included discussing two separate lawsuits filed against West Virginia in regards to its abortion ban. Earlier this month, an abortion pill manufacturer sued the state, citing that the ban violates the Supremacy Clause and the Commerce Clause of the U.S. Constitution. Then, earlier this week, the Women's Health Center, West Virginia's only abortion clinic, filed a lawsuit that seeks to block the ban while that case is being heard in federal court. Attorney General Morrissey says that he is confident that both lawsuits will be struck down in court. We think that these challenges are going to fall, that we're on very defensible grounds. I can't predict when and where that will happen, but I can say that uh, we like the position we're in to be able to defend this law. As the Attorney General of the state, I'm charged with defending a state law, and that's what we're doing here, and I'm looking forward to the opportunity to get into court. And the Attorney General's office currently preparing for its response to these lawsuits. There's no timetable on when those arguments will be heard.